think we can do more, uh, learning from various conventions. Um, and uh, we plan to implement uh, hybrid participation as much as possible. Our other goal would be diversity and inclusion uh, for various groups. Uh, one of the things we're considering that uh, we, we have rates which will be announced if we win. One of the things we're considering is a discounted rate for young people. So, and this is still in negotiation, this just came up. If you're less than 30 or 40, you might want to wait to actually buy your membership until we decide on that. The membership rates will be good through at least February 28th of 2023. Uh, MCFI has a lot of experience. We have prior small con chairs like Sharon and Jerry Sullivan. We have prior world con chairs. Leslie's in the room somewhere, I think. Uh, we have a bunch of prior world con division heads. Various members have also chaired local and regional conventions. And MCFI as a whole has run a whole bunch of conventions. Uh, this is the MCFI membership. And thank you. And as uh, Vince said, we're going to hold the questions for joint Q&A. Thank you very much. Very good. And, uh, four minutes, even better. Thank you. <laughs> Carolina. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, um, my name is Carolina, and I am here from Stockholm, and we are bidding for Smovcon in Stockholm. Uh, I would like to see if I can. I'll move forward. Just show. Yes. First, here is some picture of our, our committee. We are the Stockholm-based committee, and people here, we have done lots of, in these facilities, we have done like four Suecos, we have done Eurocons, and some of us has also, has also worked on several workers. so we are a very experienced group. Next, please. Stockholm is the capital, it's easy to get to Stockholm, this is just the Scandinavian Airlines, but we have... Orlando International Airport has air, airlines for many airlines, so it's easy to get from all over the world. Please. To get from the Orlando Airport, you can go by taxi, you can go by Orlando Express, that is the train, or you can go to by airport bus to the Stockholm bus central terminal or the Stockholm Central. Next one. Here is the thing I would like to point out. The, this is the central, and our venue is here. It is a little bit server, but it's easy to get to. You take, either you take the taxi directly there, or you go by to central, take the taxi from there, or by the metro. Going here, take the bus here. The, the metro is like two stops, so, free, so it is like a few minutes and the bus from Slutsen to Sikla is six minutes. And the bus is running very frequently from the city center to Sikla. Next, please. This is not a hotel, it is a culture center. It's Dieselwerkstam. We have had a few, a few Suecos there. It is actually it's a culture center. Usually it is lots of activities there. It is like theaters. They have a stage. They have a climbing wall. You have you have an art exhibition. You have a public library, a cafe, a restaurant, and we have booked three rooms over there. The first one is take 70. It's called the little stage. We have not booked the big stage. The other one is a room we are thinking about. Is there about 60 people room, and then we have a new room over there. So we maybe we'll have. Because we usually don't have it, don't have it has hospitality suite, but we make usually have like a staff and a green room combined, and maybe we, we will think about to have like a hospitality suite there. Here's a picture of the diesel works down, and that is the big lobby. Thank you. Yes, there is, this is a very new hotel. It opened up just one year ago. It is like 50 meters from the diesel wax, so you can almost crawl around there. It's very easy. <laughs> and, and they have 236 rooms. And the thing is that the, in the room rates, both breakfast and dinner is included. And not only that, even fika, I mean, that means coffee and cake in the middle of the day. So, and those are the rates if you book it like now, but we will have 
uh, but we will have some, some uh, um, I will talk to the hotel afterwards, see if we can have like a group reservation. It has accessible rooms, it has sauna, it has gym and whatever. And, the, the, and it is like a breakfast buffet and a dinner buffet included in the price. Here is the Sikla, the uh, area. Here is the hotel, that is the Silvaxla. It is like a little yard or whatever in the park, and that is take like 50 meters between the two. Here are the, the, the bus stop. Here's another hotel. Here's a big shopping center with lots of shops, and there are several restaurants around, five, six uh, restaurants. And then you can take the bus five, six minutes to the to the city center, and we in Stockholm we have lots of restaurants, lots of shops in the city center. It's like five to ten minutes away. We've got Twenty seconds left. Yeah, we are going to have two preliminary tracks and some program items will be streamed. Next, please. Yes, and the COVID policy. In Sweden right now, there are no, no restrictions at all, and we, don't, we will not uh, think about requiring masks, but you will, can you have it if you want? And then there's the big thing. You're, you're outside, but just if you could finish, go ahead. Okay. Oh, it is the weather, uh, cold and dark. <laughs> that, that is, this is the picture I took like uh, two days ago. It was rather pleasant there. And the last thing I would like to tell that we would like to invite on the, please next week, the Christmas buffet in Stockholm. And I would like to see if that is a good idea because it's rather expensive, but I would like to, uh, if, if you could do that, if you want to come to Stockholm, we would like to make one day so we can go have a Christmas buffet. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're going to take about 10 minutes for Q&A. Yeah. If you can clear the... Uh... Oh, there we go. Thank you. So, we're going to take questions in the room. We had some questions come in beforehand. And, Caroline, if you could sit down, because I can just grab one of the microphones between you. Uh, and uh, I'm also looking at the Zoom online. Um, if you have a question, uh, please either indicate for somebody to bring it up, or use the microphone in the middle. And if you have a question, indicate is it for one specific bid or is it for both? Okay, and if there's any others, that's fine. Okay. So a fairly easy one for both bids. What holiday events are held near your date and location? Either of you can go first. And that is a good thing, a good question, because Stockholm, we have lots of Christmas market, and I really, really like to, to, uh, that it would take to have some time to go to the old, old city where the Christmas market, and the, where the science fiction bookshop is just a block away. Mm -hmm. Really nice. And, and I also think about the, the special uh, Christmas buffet that is really, really popular. It's, it's lots of food, and I would like to take you to that. I don't believe there are actually any major holiday events. The thing would be holiday lights. Our, the our Roger uh, Park does have holiday lights, and the last water fire of the year is this weekend. Uh, is currently this weekend, certainly will be the same weekend next year. Okay, question for Boston. How to, sorry, not for Boston, for, from Boston. How to get from Boston Airport or any other airports to Providence if one doesn't drive? Uh, there's uh, there's commuter rail and Amtrak uh, service from uh, Boston South Station. There's a free uh, a sh a shuttle bus from the airport to South Station, and then you could take the commuter rail, which is uh, 2450 round trip to uh, Providence or uh, Amtrak, which is probably somewhat more. Okay. 2450 or cheaper. For Stockholm, what time is Fika? It's usually in the afternoon. It, in, uh, I think it is between three and four, and uh, it's on the web, uh, on the hotel website. But I don't. But it is in the afternoon, some around three o'clock. Thank you. Questions in the room. Further questions in the room. 
either, yeah, come up to the microphone. Thank you. Yeah. If I have a, have no questions online, one comment. You could also stay on for the Nobel Prize week events if you have time afterwards. <laughs> there we go. Especially any, if any of you are candidates for the Nobel Prize, you can hang around. Yeah. Helen, go ahead. I apologize, if, I apologize if I just, my brain did not register. Are you both looking at the traditional first weekend in December? Yes. Yes. Okay. Other questions? Very surprised you don't have any questions. Were they such good presentations? I thought they were good presentations, but. Uh, 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 I would have mentioned that we are looking about for a membership race between, uh, in, in Swedish terms, it's uh, 250 to 300 Swedish kroner, which is about a uh, little more than 25 to 30 dollars. Yeah. Question for both of you, just more of a confirmation, because there's often a lost in translation thing of what taxes are included or not included, so your hotel rates quoted, are they inclusive, exclusive of tax? It was $179 plus 13% tax, which works out to be about uh, 202 to $203. Okay. Uh, the, the ones I paid, it's included tax and other, uh, other fees, that is uh, in Swedish kroner, it's 1,300 1, Swedish kroner. That is, of course, uh, the lowest rate but uh, I don't think they're going to be so much, but so I would say like uh, a, a Swedish, uh, it is uh, 11 Swedish kroner at one dollar, so you have to divide it with 11. Okay. Google is your friend. And our hotel rates are firm uh, once we sign the contract next week, next week should we win. Okay, for Stockholm, oh this is good, will the Northern Lights be in season are they ever, uh, uh, or visible further north from Stockholm? Well, not around Stockholm, I must say. You have to go a little bit further north when it's more, uh, it's oh, way further north. North. To both bids, tell us about your virtual slash hybrid programming. Either of you go first. Um, we would expect uh, hybrid programming similar to what. Uh, uh, Albacon did, or maybe similar to what DC3 did, with uh, being able to uh, have people uh, remotely watch the program. We expect to also have some remote participants, and uh, we would expect a remote Q&A. Uh, we, we would um, uh, have both panels be hybrid as much as possible, and we would try to get uh, agreement from the program participants in, in advance. Uh, also, everything would be recorded. Should there be a technical glitch, people could watch them later. Well, uh, yes. Uh, well, uh, we will ha we will stream a few program items. We will not have a, a virtual and hybrid uh, program. We, ha we have focused on the on-site program, but some of the program, like this kind of question, uh, this. The program will be streamed up. Other questions in the room? Not seeing any. Questions online? I think we're done. Okay, barring further questions, let me thank both bidders. And now we go to voting. So on the tables in the room, you will find in the middle some pens, some ballot forms. Just fill in the name of the bid that you prefer, or the initial S, or either M for MCFI or P for Providence. Uh, and then our mutual assistants will come around and collect those. Those of you online, just send a private message on the Zoom, and we'll collect them on the Zoom. Uh, this is the moderator, so who are they going to be sending the private message to? Uh, to the moderator, if you can collect them. Thank okay. you very much. Yeah. Just indicate which bit. That's all you need to send. And you can just let them know the totals afterwards. Okay. Sorry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In fact, what we'll do is while we're tallying, the, the bids, I think there's a bid for 24. The ones that come, we'll get them to do that while we're tallying and we'll come back. Anybody need a ballot? Um, the people behind the screen, if you want one. 
Okay? We're not allowed. Okay. Any more ballots in the room? Any more ballots? So, who, anyone sending to the moderator? The moderator could let us know. Thank you. So, we have a result. The votes are, and thank you to the beautiful tellers, the votes are uh, Stockholm 28, Providence 37. So, the SMOFCON will go in next year, will go to Providence. <laughs> well done to both bids. Good results. If Providence wants to say any few words, please, very few. Uh, okay, and we, we uh, will be taking memberships later. The uh, full attending rate, which would also allow hybrid, will be $50. The hybrid only rate would be $35. The family membership would be 30, a family or hospitality membership would be $30. Uh, we uh, will work on printing out some forms. Uh, we also will be able to take PayPal and we have a Google form up for people who want to do that. The rates will be good through um, February 28th of 2023. Uh, and you can see me or Sharon or one of the other people later if you have questions. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. This part of the session is over and we'll now hand over to the future WUSPAS.